Inspector General of Police Tan Sri Khalid Abu Bakar says the police are not aware why the Australian government issued a travel advisory about possible terror attacks in Malaysia. Kami pun tidak tahu apa basisnya uh, advisory ini dikeluarkan. Saya merasa a bit disappointed ya, kerana jika mereka mengetahui sesuatu, sepatutnya mereka kongsikan bersama dengan kita. Ya, kerana kita akan selalu share apa juga maklumat uh, berkenaan dengan apa juga keadaan keselamatan khususnya berkenaan dengan uh, kegiatan teroris. Ya. Jadi dalam hal ini uh, saya tidak tahu apa asasnya bahawa advisory ini dikeluarkan. Earlier, he accompanied the Prime Minister Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak on a walkabout of the tourist area of Bukit Bintang. On Sunday, a travel advisory posted on the Australian Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade website stated that attacks could be indiscriminate and Western interests or locations frequented by Westerners were possible targets. It advised Australians to reconsider the need to travel to the coastal regions of eastern Sabah. The UK also warned its citizens against travelling to coastal islands in Sabah's east coast, bordering the Philippines. In a move to show that Malaysia is safe, Prime Minister Dato' Sri Najib Tun Razak, Khalid and several ministers took a walk at Pavilion Mall on Monday. Among those present were Defence Minister Dato' Sri Hishamuddin Hussein, his Deputy Dato' Johari Baharom, Deputy Home Ministers Dato' Nur Jazlan Muhammad and Dato' Masir Kujat, and Armed Forces Chief General Tan Sri Zulkifli Muhammad Din. Khalid says more than 300 personnel from police and the armed forces had been deployed in 24-hour patrols over the city and strategic places to ensure the safety of the public.